to witness a lot more uh, extraterrestrial activity, um, UFOs, UAPs, whatever you want to refer to them as. Currently, there is a massive ship that's actually parked behind our sun. These ships actually charge using the sun. They charge using plasma energy. Y'all can laugh. Y'all can say this is a joke. These are the same beings that actually popped up in, uh, in Miami, whose coordinates were reversed and meant to go to Antarctica. For those that aren't aware, Antarctica is our entry point to Agartha, which is the center of the Earth. This is what Admiral Byrd was making reference to when he was talking about going to the center of the Earth. He showed us in movies like Journey to the Center of the Earth and a recent King Kong movie. All of these beings, giants, dragons, all that exist in the center of the earth. You can always count on them to show us the truth through Hollywood cinema. The Bermuda Triangle is another entry point to the center of the earth. This is why in the King Kong movie, you've seen them going through the water. Oceans in the water is one big portal. This is also why there has been mentions of a large creature being seen swimming underwater now. Titans are making a return. So some of the large objects that y'all see in the water may not actually be the Leviathan. Some of them can also be ships. Remember, these extraterrestrials do enter our realm via water. The water is a big portal. Now, what I personally believe is a lot more extraterrestrial activity is coming in through the water. And what's happening is these ships do emit electromagnetic frequencies. And what those electromagnetic frequencies, I believe, is making it uncomfortable for the marine life. I believe this is why they're... Y'all are about to